Welcome back to ep episode two of oh 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 I can press home, can't I? There we there we go. Welcome back. Let's try that again. Welcome back to episode two of my Mega Aquarium Let's Play series, in which we build an aquarium. So I hope you guys liked the first one. Uh, here we are, and I've forgotten everything. What have we got to do? So let's have a look. Combined science across animals zero out of forty. So we got our science points from the Kerbal video. Uh, it was green harvest, but <laughs> okay. So I'm just trying to get to grips with what's happening here. So let me think. What does this mean? This animal. Needs, so we have. Oh, so that just tells you. So we have all the orange pellet dispensers. Okay, so it looks like... Sorry, I'm confused. I thought all the tanks had to have filters. Oh, no, they're the combi filters, aren't they? Okay, never mind. Oh, that's clever. So you can have them split between two... Oh, that's clever. That's clever, mate. Sorry, I'm just <laughs> trying to figure out this game as I go along, really. Okay, so now I've got to grips. First things first, I agree. We need some staff. Claire. I saw her application and immediately thought, well, that's when you her. And, of course, we get the best part of this game where... The staff sort of fuse <laughs> upon being hired. Oh, it's always paused until we open it. Okay. So, build a tool station. Yeah, so this is kind of the biggest staff area, right? So we could probably expand the aquarium like this way. And then these staff areas can then serve tanks to this side and up there as well. So we have room for expansion here. We have the potential room. But then this one's in quite a good location as well. So... Ooh, we'll have to we'll have to wait and see where where the where the game takes us. So, I think for the moment though, it would be a good idea to put it here. I thought let's have a look. So we'll build. Uh, I don't want to put them anywhere too kind of potentially blocking off space where tanks could go. So we'll just put a few back to back there. And oh, we have lots of new decorations. And I thought I saw mussels dispenser. I don't, think, I don't think we need that yet, but I think it would be useful to kind of start planning ahead. Because the uh, the current owners of this aquarium clearly didn't plan ahead. Like, what is this useless piece of space right here? Okay. Right, and... Okay, and combined science across... So add animals to your aquarium until the combined value of cross the tanks is 40. Okay. So, oh my god, that looks cool. A zebra moray eel. So what do we need? We need... It requires water quality of 65%. So, how do I look at the actual stats for the tanks? Uh, here we go. Uh, uh, low quality is reducing... Losing the health of the animals. Is there an, an eel in there? Okay. Well, I assumed it was a clever idea by having the combined filters, but it's clearly not actually doing enough, is it? So, let's just fix this. Oh, yeah, of course. It's not built into walls, is it? Okay. Looks like I've got to take on more than I anticipated. Gonna build that like that, and then we'll build a little a thingy, a thingy of a bob, a thingy of a bob there. There we go, and now we can add some filters. Okay, so if we're gonna add some moray eels, where could they go? Could they go in there? I feel like it would need a big tank though. This looks fairly big, doesn't it? Let's pick one there. Okay, and I shouldn't have put the tool stations there, should I? I mean, I've probably got way too many tool stations as it is. We only need two for now. So, we're going to put some filters in. Oh my god, a power filter. Okay, this changes everything. We need one. And look, I can do I can do this. Hang on. Uh, we'll just... We'll stick this one... Uh, that looks fine. And um, we'll add a power filter between the two. Oh. What have I done? Hang on. I, did, I, sh I should have read it. Oh, so, um, okay, well, I don't know what, I don't know what that was then. Okay, right, so this is still low quality water, is it? Did I even read this properly? The power filter maintain excess water on medium tanks. I think we'll have a, we'll have a power filter and a basic filter, and I've, I've blocked off the big, big, it's not going well, this episode. I feel like last episode was far more successful, don't really know what I'm doing this time. Okay, so this looks pretty good. Let's put a moray eel in there. Tank is full. With what? With what? These tanks look fairly okay, don't they? 
So I just placed my first, it will start small but grow larger over time. Great animals are worth more points. They will only grow if you fulfill their care requirements. Make sure there is enough space in the tank for them to grow into. Hover over the growth time icon to find how many days it takes to, it was four days, wasn't it? Yeah, it was four. Wait. We'll grow to nine after four days. Oh, so it goes to the size of nine fish, okay. So we'll leave that as it is. And uh, it will eat crustaceans, okay. And we need two caves, right? Requirement plus two. So it's the game's still paused. We should be okay for a moment. And uh, the Driftwood Cave is worth three. Okay, cool. So we actually need one of those. In fact, I feel we should put the cave near the, the front of the tank, right? If it's going to live in the cave. Okay, and let's put some rubble in there as well. Okay, let's not. I uh, changed my mind. <laughs> Can't for that anyway. Right, so I just want to make sure I fulfill this thing's... This tank needs to be fed with mussels. I put a mussels thing in here, so we're okay. I don't think the tasks get assigned until it's done anyway. Right, so... I just want to make sure... Mussels dispenser... Yeah, that's fine, we've got muscle. I think that's fine. Uh, power heater! Oh, right, so this is getting complicated. So, the, the Murray eel... He needs water quality of 65. I feel like I'm being really dumb. How? Let's just untoggle everything. What does this do? Okay, we don't need that. We don't need that. Oh, there you go. There's the point toggles. I just want to close everything. Okay, access is currently being blocked because I put the muscles thing there. We'll stick that near the... Further there. I don't know how, how do you quickly look at, oh, oh, I'm stupid, it's here. <laughs> I was thinking it was all up here, it's here, right, okay. So the quarter quality is 60. No, I want this tank. Can I rename the tanks? Yeah. So we'll go eel tank. So let's see, we've got high quality, we've got six caves, everything's, for, oh, so that's quite useful, it just tells you if you're meeting the requirements or not. So it's, we, we have capacity for one eel in there, so we can't have another one, but we can put some more fish in there. And we do have, and it's not a crustacean, so we're fine. There we go. And we'll put some in there as well. Okay. And in fact, let's put another eel in. And we'll add a cave for him. And we've got a muscle dispenser in there as well. Okay. And the water quality is terrible. So we need to. So what's the water quality here with this tank? It's paused, right? So it won't matter at the moment. Six, so we only actually need 1% more, so there's no point in putting like a massive filter on, we'll just stick a small one on. And I'm ready to open. Okay, that was a mistake, because we still haven't... Hang on. Hang about. The aquarium is restocked and it's open to public access once again. Because all the tanks at Northwoods are embedded into walls. They are called, imaginatively, wall tanks. Oh, okay, so I wasn't wrong when I did my previous aquarium. You don't need to build a wall to get that little trim there. Wall tanks are used by guests from one side and are accessed by staff via the other. This allows you to keep your equipment behind closed doors. Talking of doors, the staff door... Mate, I've already, I'm already a I'm one step ahead of you, mate. Okay, well, we'll sort that out in a second. I don't want my zebrafish to die just yet. Okay, hang on, let's have a look. So, he wants... He... He dislikes conspecifics. Cannot be housed with a flame angel fish. But he is a flame angel fish. Does that, does conspecifics mean he can't be housed with other people like him? My English is not good, you know. <laughs> He's greedy. Okay, great. This is very, very, very complicated now. Uh, I like the look of this guy, so let's get that guy. And power combi. Oh, that's what we want. And we want a pump as well. What do we want a pump for? Can connect to tanks. Oh, so when we had the power filter, it means you can connect it remotely. That's a really good idea. Okay. Well... Let's research that because we already we can already do the basic combi by just using the lower powered stuff. So I'd rather use the stuff that we can't do whatsoever yet. So again, this aquarium is a terrible layout, isn't it? Let's just let's just move this boy. Let's move that to there, and we'll stick a fill basic filter here. Whatever. 
and um, oh, I've, I've messed up, haven't I? Oh, it's all going wrong. Um, uh, just stick that, just stick that anywhere. I don't care. Uh, I just want, I want fish to die. Okay, so we're, we're good for the moment. So what we'll do, we'll, we'll put a door here. And then what we can do, you see, we can kind of have a filter here and there. And they'll both, well, we can just have a filter there and it won't be blocking off this corridor. So, and then we'll build a door, a wall. God, that was stressful. I think I messed that up, actually. It doesn't look in line. Oh, no, the others are like that as well. Right. Okay, so. Just making sure there's no warnings popping up, is there? Which is the warnings thing again. Okay, that's going well. Phew. It was pretty stressful, guys, but we pulled through. So I'm just going to let things sort of stabilise. Let's build some benches as well for people. Uh, benches. Benches, where were they? Oh, does, does that mean the eels are growing? Oh, I'll have a look in a second. Uh, let's pop some benches down. Oh, we can put some benches around here, can't we? Okay, never mind them. Nice. Maybe we can put some in the middle as well. Alright then. So let's have a look. We have access. We can build stuff down here. I think this is probably the. This seems like the most sensible place to expand because we can kind of build it around this giant staff room. So let's do that. So we'll build up like this. We'll build up. I'll build it around. How much money have I got? Okay, we've still got loads of money left. Alright, so it's going well, and we should probably... Uh, how much, okay, we've got loads of money, so let's have, let's have a think. What have we got unlocked? We're still researching that guy, I guess. Oh, I've still, I've got, I've still got my old ones, okay. Let's build some, like, little tanks. Let's recreate the classic. Uh, oh, actually, let's try building some stuff. Let's just, let's just pause this. Uh, delete tool. Oh, no, it's not. It's, it's this one, isn't it? Because this isn't actually a wall, is it? It's like the actual structure. So, I'm going to create art right now. So, we want observer tank, right? And it will, like, jut out like this. Have I run out of money? No, I haven't. Can we, like, combine those with corner tanks? Well, the dream is dead. Oh, well. Can I do that? Can I do that? No, okay. Never mind them. Was that observer tank? I probably should have done. Whatever. We'll have, like, a little tank there. Okay. And then we can have all, like, the bits and bobs that power them in the middle. Yes, 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 see? So we'll add a wall there. And the door will be here. So then we'll just wall off this bit. Like that. I'm an idiot. This doesn't work because this tank can't access anything. Okay, let's just let's just hold hold up, hold up. Let's let's think this through. So every tank needs a big thing. Can these power? Wait. So the, can these power any like just things next to them? So we need probably need power filters. Oh, so when it's, you can't have it power two things. Okay, I assumed for some reason that it could power more than one thing if it was next to more than one thing. Okay, whatever. Uh, we do need he basic heater as well. Well, let's have the power heater. I don't know if there's any incentive to not have a power heater. There probably is, but I'm too lazy to look it up at this point. Oh, no, because you can draw a line, right? Okay, never mind. Hang on. So does it or does it need to be adjacent to the tank it's powering? Yeah, it does. Okay. So this is a horrible layout. <laughs> uh, what's this one powering actually? Because we can just reassign this one, right? So that, and then we'll add. I know, mate. I'm getting there. I'm getting there. What did I just? 
A combi mini. Okay, there we go. And we'll get rid of that. Okay, and then we'll add a power heater. Whew. Okay. It's not the greatest layout, but it will do. Surely this is inaccessible now. Oops, I didn't mean to delete that. Undo. What did I, what did I even just delete? Was it the was it the <laughs> it was the combi? Okay. There we go. Right. I think that's fixed now. So we'll build a little corner tank again. Whoops. In fact, does it need to be an observer tank actually? I don't know. <laughs> corner tank. Let's do a corner tank. And it kind of wraps its way around. Cool. And then we'll add our filter on our heater. And our filter. And our wall. And another wall. Okay. And then we'll add another... And the whole thing kind of loops around, so we've got a nice little a little circuit. So another, we'll add another corner tank, shall we? Nice. And then we'll add our staff door. Where is the staff door? There it is. Okay, and we've got so much room in here now, we can't possibly run out. Those are some famous last words if I ever heard them. I, mean, I, feel, I feel like... Does, does the combi, like, let's have a look. It provides combined, he's saving you space, but it's only suitable for the smallest of tanks. That's what I mean. So I feel like these aren't very small, these tanks. So we'll just go, I'd rather go overkill. We've got loads of money. you got to spend money to make money. So let's just, let's just go risk going overkill. In fact, we've already got a door for this area, haven't we? So we don't actually need this here, do we? So we've got those things there, so now we can probably just add another little tank, can't we? Oh no, that, that renders those things inaccessible, doesn't it? Whoops! Okay, uh... Wall tank. How small can we make the wall tanks? No, we can't make it any smaller. Darn! Oh, actually, we can have it jutting out, can't we? Because that's what they did on the other side. And that still leaves these inaccessible, though. But that can be moved to there. So we're fine. And... That's the smallest tank size, right? So we're going to have to have a... I've just realized we're going to have to have a combi for this one because we can't have two things. Alrighty, righty, righty. And then what we can do, we can use the middle. God, it's such a mess, isn't it? We can use the middle of this room to have, like, all the feeding stuff. So let's have... I mean, do we... we I, I don't think we need... Do we need more than one orange and pellet? Where's it? Where's everything gone? Here we go. The UI is not the easiest to see, is it? If we just have, like, another orange... And another green... And then a mussels... Uh, uh, like that, that's fine. And then that should be fine. We only need one tool station in there, I would have thought, right? Don't need more than one. So there we go. And then we'll just, how much money have we got? We ain't got much money left, I don't think. No, we haven't. So let's just unpause now. Like I say, these, these boys are, oh, what's happening? This needs to be fixed using a toolkit. Is he on the case? Mates, uh, talents. Do we need to train him? Who's on the case? Um, a tank which guests cannot access. As in, they can't see the back of it, right? Well, we've already done that. But we need we need this fixed. Is he fixing it? He's fixing. Okay, it's fine then. Right, so let's just, um, we got some money coming in now. So we'll start, oh, let's put some eel grass in. Well, I'd like another eel tank, all right. We'll put some grass like that, and then we'll add some caves for him. 
And then we'll add a little, a little, a little plant. There we go. That's a nice little. Oh, and it can like weave through the grass. And then we'll add an eel. And what is the capacity of this tank actually? Yes, nicely done. Oh, I've got all the things straight away. Okay, so let's just make sure. So this can sustain 15, but the eel grows to nine, so we can't have more than one eel. But all of that's fine. So let's have a look. Can the eel not go with anyone? No, he can't eat, he, he'll eat crustaceans, but that's it. So he's a wimp, but the, 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 the zebra eel is pretty docile. Let's just make sure this is okay. So we have seven, but it's going to grow by five. So we're fine with that, actually. We'll leave it as it is. We don't want to overcrowd the tank, though. The animal tanks. Yeah, we've got orange pellets in there, though. This guy's on the job. I feel like we need another staff member, though. There we go. We've got some more staff. Right. Now let's uh, fill up. Yep, they're on the case. Don't worry about it, mate. So then we need some more fish. Let's have a look. Have we unlocked that other one I was researching yet? No, we haven't. Let's have all of these can go together, right? Except this guy. Except, no, which is the bully again? Do we even have any bullies? Where's the bully? I'm sure I had a bully. It was the, was it the Arabian? I don't think it's here anyway, because neither is the shellfish. Okay, so we can just have like one of each maybe. I haven't really looked at their tank requirements yet. I'm just going to add them and then worry about it later. Okay, now what, does they, what do they need? None of them need any special things, do they? Okay, uh, he needs a cave though, so we'll add him and we'll add a cave. There we go, and we'll add a, a rubble. Nice. Okay, and then we'll add some more fish. Yellow tang. We don't want to fill up all the tanks though, we still got those two there though. Yellow tang, and they again don't require anything, which is nice. Can they go in there? No, we'll stick them in there. And Yellow Tang's not a bully. No, we'll add some more because they look quite nice. And let's add some rocks, maybe. And some lettuce. Beautiful. Nice. Okay, so now I'm, pro I'm quite happy to just leave this. Or we can let's have an open tank. I quite liked having an open Okay, we don't have any open tanks available platforms. Should I add like a thing like this so that staff can actually get to the... I feel like that hasn't worked. <laughs> Whatever. In fact, why do we... Why don't we just use this space to carry... have like another tool station? Because I feel like we don't have enough tool stations. I feel like one is probably not enough. There we go. Alrighty, righty, righty! Yes! Yes! I did it! So, that's the only one available. Right, the dislikes, consp which means only one may be kept per tank. Let's find them. Flame Angelfish. We'll stick him in there. Now, I didn't actually check his requirements once again. But he doesn't actually need anything other than none, no fish of the same kind. Okay. I feel like that must make him a rarer thing, because it's more inconvenient to place lots of them in an aquarium. So if you have lots, you probably get more points for having... Now. There is no... Wait, wait, whoa, whoa, whoa. I feel like something's gone wrong here. There is no route between this task and a supply of green pellet. So they, an area of the tank has to be exposed then, does it? Is that how it's going to be? Right. Okay, so I... Let's just... Argument's sake. Okay, yeah, so now it's okay. So let's quickly... Stick a combi in. Where is it? Is that okay? I think we're okay. I think we're okay. <laughs> Whew, okay. Nice. So I guess it was a complete waste having all these power filters if we a combi does a tank of that size. Alright. Is my zebrafish finished growing yet? I'm sure in the trailers for this game, 
you could like go down to floor level. I guess this is oh I guess this is floor level here. Oh I've got a message. Oh it's grown! <gasps> Size nine. Let's have a look. Let's have a look. Where is he? May I wish I could I'm sure there is a, a camera option. Here we go. Let's have a look. Graphics, no. Uh, orbit modifier. Left control. Maybe that's it. No, it's not. It's the same as middle mouse. I mean, like, this is fine. Sweet. So I'm just gonna let it sort of sit, let things sort of settle, settle down. Oh, actually, hang on, that fish is gonna starve. But we can, it's okay because we can move that, and then that's fine. So I just want to make sure all of them have access to food now. I didn't realise that caveat existed, but it does make sense when you think about it, doesn't it? <laughs> so let's think. Every tank needs a filter and a heater. So small tanks only need one. Okay. Yes! I don't think I actually need that. They did a power combi. Okay. I don't think any of these tanks actually necessitate that just yet. But in fact, that makes it easier. Because the problem right now of having like a, fil a power filter and a power heater is that both kind of need to be accessible. So that's kind of two tiles that each need their own accessibility point. But if it's like one unit that takes up two tiles, it could in theory be like placing... It would be the, it would be the same as placing this one here. Normally it would block off that. But if it's only one unit... You see what I mean? I hope that makes sense. <laughs> I mean, that could be, I could be way off here, but that, that, that's how I would interpret, that's what I would interpret that to mean. Uh, beautiful. All right. I take a screenshot. Let's have a look. F2. Okay, never mind then. What do all the F buttons do? That's what I generally do in games. Oh, no, that's taking a GOG screenshot. Okay, what's this? Is there a warning? There's no warnings. Grow. Oh, oh! Our prestige is flying up. So, I feel like this space could be better utilised. Let's put another tank. We've got a lot of cash. We've got some cash money. So, it's probably a little bit... This little thing's probably a little bit claustrophobic, isn't it? Let's, uh... Let's just undo that. Well, oh, yep, thank you. Let's take a look. A couple of care requirements you haven't seen before. They are greedy, which means they eat more and lower water quality more than other animals. They dislike on specifics. They mate fish and crustaceans which are smaller than itself. Hover over the warning icon to find out more. Let's hover over the warning icon to find out more. Or is it that one there? Fish with size 2 or less. Hang on, mate. I'll get that in a second. So what size is... How do you find out what size they are? Okay, so 3. So right now, that thing can't eat any fish. Okay, it can. The top ones. Oh, so it kind of it ranks it by size, it looks like. Or, you know, attribute. Okay, let's have a look. It's time to learn about pumps. Pumps allow you to remotely... Lo yes! I was hoping this would exist. Okay, I'm going away from your tank. Instead of having it to your filters and he's direct to the tank, you can attach them to the pump, which is several tiles away. Demonstrate your understanding of tanks by building up. Let's do it then. I kind of wanted an open tank. Yes, I can do that now. Where did I plan on putting that? Oh, yeah, I was planning on putting it here. Although on reflection, I haven't really got a room to put the pump in. I think we ought to expand a little bit. Let's build like a sort of plaza area. There we go. And um, we'll build a lagoon. A nice big one. In fact, I don't really, I really want it to be a little bit more centre, you know. Oh, dream's dead. It can't be central. Whatever. And then we'll add a little staff room somewhere. Well, actually, no. Let's, let's, I'll tell you what we'll do. We'll add some wall tanks and then kind of put the staff room inside. 
this should probably be a corner tank, shouldn't it? Hang on, hang about, hang about, hang about, hang about, hang about. We want like this. There we go. And I guess I've probably not left enough rooms. We'll just we'll leave that as it is for now. We'll put a wall there. Hang on. Just put some walls there for now. They can be deleted later on if necessary. I don't really want to put the staff door next to a tank, you know, because I'll block things off. So this is a good start so far. Okay, so now let's so let's see what's required. The water quality. Oh, so is there any? I'm not. I still need a bit more practice at this game to understand. So let's let's do this now. So this looks like quite a big tank, right? So we probably need the power tools. Okay, it has to be, we have to place the pump first. Okay, so we have placed the pump. So basic pump. So all of the tank stuff can go here. Then all these tanks can go like around the edges there. So we'll put the pump there. Nice. What is the actual range of the pump? Can that go to there, for example? Okay, so it's quite a big. It can go quite far. Oh, it it shows you. It shows you on the on the grid. Let me just check check that. Pump, pump, pump. Oh yeah. Okay, so it's huge. Okay. It'd be nice if you could like do upstairs and downstairs. Although I guess that would take away some of the challenge of the game. Okay, so I'll have I I feel like that would need power heating stuff, wouldn't it? So we'll put power stuff. Where is power filter? Now. How's that looking? Seems fine, doesn't it? So this is such a big tank. I feel like we can now... It would justify having a big... We can put two eels in there so they got friends. Oh, God. Hang on. Water temperature is too low. It's got a power heater, mate. Damn. It's okay. Um... Let me think this through. Uh, uh, okay, I got it. We'll just put another pump down. <laughs> this is why I'm paid the top dollar, you know. Where is the pump? Sorry, there we go. So, can we... We couldn't put that there, so we'll have to put it here. And then we'll stick a heater down. It'll be worth it. There we go. Oh, it's still not hot enough. Damn, how hot do you need it, man? Is it because it's a lagoon tank? Uh, it's okay. We can have... Oh, my God. Okay, power heater. One of my guests is thirsty. Well, I don't care right now. My fish are dying. But the water quality is fine right here. Okay, well, it needs a case. We could, I don't need to worry about that too much. Okay. Actually, what I should probably do, I probably should put them in the centre. Whatever. And um, we'll add some beautification stuff. Ah, uh, ba ba. There we go. And then. Ah, oh, beautiful. Oh mate, look at that! That's sick! It like goes down into the floor. Mate, I'm very, I'm so happy right now. Alright, so let's try putting the new fish. What do we have? He's the greedy one, right? Oh, we haven't got any stony corals, that's fine. Where's the greedy one? Is it that one? I've already forgotten what we just unlocked. I'm sure it was the, it was the coral grouper. Oh yeah, he, well the zebra things are fine. So if we just... Okay, now what's happened? Oh god, yeah! Where is it? Where is he? There we go. Uh, let's just stick him in... Uh, this one? Okay. Well, the game seems to warn you if you're going to mess it up, so we're fine. Okay. And... Right, good. Let's add some more fish. We can't have anything bigger than a... T uh, sm smaller than a two. And he likes caves, so we may as well put him in there. Does he just like conspecifics as well? I've already forgotten. I don't think so. And... Oh, yellow tang. They're quite good. And size, big, big boy. Flame angel fish. He's... Yes! That's going to make my life so much easier. 
Okay, uh, and then... Oh, flame Angel. Oh, God, I just remember the zebrafish are going to grow, aren't they? How's this tank doing? Let's just... Lagoon, so you can actually... So, how many fish are in there? Oh, we got huge. Okay, this, this is a huge tank, so we're going to be fine. So, in reality, they grow up to size 9, right? And they're size 4 to begin with. So, there's like... In reality, there's actually 41 fish in here right now. So, we can actually add way more. That's another eel. There we go. I think we'll leave it for now. We don't want it too crowded. Oh, mate, that's a beautiful little tank, though. Nah, let's fill it up. <laughs> How big is this thing? I'm just keeping an eye on the on the number of fish. Still got still got loads. We'll get it to like um, actually how many how many zebras do I have? One, two, three, four. All right, let's just let the eels grow because they all seem to be growing at different rates now. So we'll let them grow and then we'll have a look at a later date. And we'll we'll put some muscles things within easy within easy reach of the thing. Where is it? There it is. Nice. Okay, cool. Uh, we need some orange pellet as well. So let's stick some feeding stuff in here. So we'll, we'll try and put orange pellet stuff in these tanks in this room. So then you know we kind of. Don't have to get the staff to walk around too much. This is a horribly designed room, isn't it? Going to have to expand. Let's just build that out there. Now we can move that. We can move that to there. Move that to there. Okay. Nice one. Right. So we did build an English. Okay, that was it, yeah. One of the guests was thirsty. Can't be having that. We don't want him drinking from the lagoon tank. Let's just try and find those awkward blank patches of wall. There we go. Um, so I don't want the corridors to be too narrow. That's the thing. That one by the entrance. Have some by the benches here. Okay, cool. We've ranked up. Level up. Congratulations on reaching rank 4. Among the new animals you can unlock at this rank are the first crustaceans. This blue knuckle hermit crab is a great... Oh, one of my fish can eat crustaceans, can't they? Okay. But it doesn't need feeding. It actually provides additional filtering. Oh, nice. I mean, why does it need feeding? <laughs> oh, these are the attributes. Okay. All right. You now have your final objective. I mean, you may also... Oh, so maybe I should do my final objective before I end this episode. Uh, oh, we've got to write you a lot of points as well. You know, if I, you must receive additional optional objectives from third parties in return for fulfilling certain requirements that offer you a reward. It's completely up to you whether you comply with their requests, but you may find it easier to meet your objectives if they do. Okay. Close. Uh, I feel it doesn't really matter. We need both, don't we? And... Let's have a look. Fox face rabbit fish, reef squirrel fish. What is that? I dislike lights. Armored. Oh mate, that looks that looks sick. Let's go with the crustacean though. I'd like to get a new subtype. I think I don't I can't remember what I've been putting in these tanks now. I've just been kind of shoving as much in as I can, so we'll create a dedicated new tank for the crustaceans. So I think what we'll do, we'll expand this entire area and we'll do another kind of loop like here. Because this is quite, I think this worked out quite well. This layout. So let's just spend all of our money. <laughs> right. Now it's a question of whether we do more lagoon tanks. Or if we do more wall tanks. I really like the lagoon tank. But then again, I also have an appreciation for this kind of tank as well. I feel like there are going to be other tanks we can do. Let's do like a square of corner tanks. So we don't want to have them too claustrophobic. Let's have a nice little gap of about three tiles. And I, from, from experience, I feel like we need... Uh, uh, that, like that. That should be fine because we've got the double ones now, haven't we? And then we'll have a nice big space in the middle. 
This is gonna get out of hand really quickly again, isn't it? As long as we have a gap of one between each one, we're fine, right? That's a big tank. So... And then... We'll have another wall tank. No, actually, we'll have another... No, we'll have another wall tank. This... I feel like this is way not enough space. <laughs> Oh dear! Oh, screw you, litter pick droppers. I'm just spend money because you're too lazy. If we do it like this, that kind of frees up a little bit of space on the inside. Okay, and then we'll build some walls. Actually, I say what we'll do. We'll do it like this. Look, watch this. I'm so smart. Uh, where's the wall tool? <laughs> he says, forgetting where the wall tool is. We'll do it this way, right? We'll recess these, so then we have a little slot for like vending machines and stuff. In fact, one of those needs to be where the staff door goes, isn't it? Whoops. I wish, if, if I may humbly suggest features for this dev, if you're watching, if we could have an undo tool, that would be swell. I'm just like instinctively pressing Control Z and then realizing that that doesn't happen in this game. Uh, okay, we need the staff door. There we go, before that person gets in. So we'll leave those tanks as they are for the moment. Oh, actually, look, we need to build the last wall, don't we? No! You! Damn it, if I lose points for this, where is Leo? I should drown you in my lagoon. I can't. <laughs> okay, we'll leave all those for now. Because we need to get on the cleanup duty. So this is quite a useful little lobby space, isn't it? Let's have a look. Broom sand. Now, does this need to be out of sight? I don't. It doesn't say it needs to be out of sight. So let's just put it like here. You can use the amount of time. Yeah, we're we'll gonna leave bins around. Okay. Well, let's. I'd like to stick some. Uh, let's not put the tool stations there, but let's put some. Blah, 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 blah. Where is the? There we go. Fizzy drinks. There. Oh, look, it's perfect. No one is going to complain about a lack of toilets now. Lack of toilets? Lack of... I mean, that's got to be... We, we, there must be an option to build toilets at some point, right? <laughs> um, bins. So we'll place bins basically everywhere. You can never have too many. Right in front of the tank. Great. GG. Well done. Let's not put one there. Let's put a couple there. It's not great. I'm already thinking about where I'm putting these. There we go. Okay, we're doing well. We're making lots of money. So let's just sort out these tanks here. So the crustaceans don't really need filters then, from what I understood. So how is our research for the crustacean doing? We've all got a while, I think, haven't we? So let's focus on... Power combi. Okay, so... So you see, now we've got the double thing, that makes it so much easier. So we'll, we'll put the awkward corner tanks with the double combis, and then the ones with the most access, so these two can have like dedicated stuff. Yeah, that's fine. Okay. Day 13, nice. So these ones are all pretty much ready to go. So what do we not have yet? I wish there was like a thing that showed you how much you have of a thing. So what do we need? We need science points, right? So number of ecology points. So we need ecology points to unlock animals and science points to get the, the kit. So which one nets us the most of both? And then we'll go with that. So, oh, actually, we should probably put some food sta food stashes down as well. So if I've done this right, which I probably haven't, but if I have done it right, we have space in the middle. I've not done it right. Not Not very well anyway. I'm just going to go ahead and assume that we only need, like, one of each box. I don't plan on putting any more eels in this zone, so we don't need the mussels dispenser. So let's stick some stuff in. Oh, that's quite a big one. That'd be quite good for the corner of these tanks, wouldn't it? Probably this tank would be better, actually. And... Oh, let's stick some rubble down. Uh... 
And then we'll stick some kelp down. That looks sick. Need a deep tank. This is a deep tank, right? Hang on, mate. Oh, I nearly... <laughs> I nearly deleted the tank. How do I get rid of that thing? There we go. No. No. Let's just move it somewhere under there. Uh, and then, can we put kelp in this one? Uh, kelp. Yes! Mate, that's beautiful now. Okay, so we're, we're netting in... Oh, I've not got much money. I <laughs> just noticed how little money I have. Well, we'll just have to let that... That'll kind of tick over, won't it? We'll, we'll, yes. Then we need the power heater, I suppose. Oh, God, these tanks are depressing, aren't they? Just noticed. They've got like, nothing in them. Let's stick some grass. I haven't got much money. Now I do already think about... My spending... Is this like really expect? I spent £308 on rocks. I feel like I would have gone to a better supplier for those. Whatever. Uh, let's take some sea lettuce in as well. Uh, have we got uh, anything else? We're not done yet? Maybe... No, we haven't. Okay, put some small rocks in. There we go. That's better. Oh, God. I'm getting a lot of warnings. Do you think we need to hire more staff? I feel like we do. Probably can't afford it, though. There we go. Okay, nice. Let's take some benches down as well. You know, I'm hemorrhaging money. But you know, you got to spend money to make money. It'd be nice actually to have some benches around the lagoon, wouldn't it? There we go. Whew, right. So now I guess we just let the money... Watch the money pile up. See, these guys, like, he's thirsty, and he's walked past all of my vending machines. There we go. New animals! Yes, right. So now, we're going to pick the next research. I want to get that one. But we're going to have the... So I want the crustacean tank. I built the rocks for the crustacean. So let's look. Where is he? We'll have three in there. This is, like, the crustacean tank. There he is! Oh! And they don't grow, right? No, okay. So, he will eat... This guy doesn't eat anything. Let's stick him in there. Uh, which ones eat crustaceans? Just so I know. <laughs> Just so I don't accidentally place... This guy must eat crustaceans, right? Uh, I'm trying to really concentrate now. Where would that be? Um, there, what's that? No, dislikes lights. Cave lover. Where's the guy that eats crustaceans? I'm sure I've seen that. Well, the game will warn me, won't it? Right. Oh. He needs... He needs something. What do you need, man? He needs plants. Okay. I got you, man. I got you, man. There we go. Let's stick, and what does he do again? I've already forgotten what I put in there. He needs that. What can he do? He will he, he will eat or damage. Okay, we're fine. So we can put this guy in. How's that? Because we've got the crabs to filter the water, right? So that's fine. Whew, God, that was stressful. How's our prestige doing? It's falling. It's, gr it's growing, okay. It's okay. It's okay, we're good. I feel like this tank is probably needs needs some sort of addressment, doesn't it? Yes, we got a little. We should probably like. See, the thing is, right? We could assign a staff member to each little room, so it's just one or two. St oh my god! Look at the eels. Yo, yo, that's sick, bro. Oh, I like that. That's cool. Oh. Yo! Wait, what? Nobody's doing anything. Mate, it's what am I paying you for? This door is definitely accessible, right? Yeah. Ah, oh, they'll do it eventually. 
this it doesn't like the proximity of the muscles tank doesn't matter right I sound, I feel like I should probably just hire more staff oh manager should I oh no I thought I could hire a manager so we've got to earn oh okay well, well that we'll get there we'll get there so our money is rising again so I feel like this tank we got look we got a space for a big heater and a big filter and nothing else so that's not a great idea is it um but no because we can what we can do we can move this we can move this like to here and then we can add a big filter and a big heater here and that still wouldn't work so check it we assign this one to here no we don't We'll leave that tank's empty. We don't need this one just yet. We assign. We'll do this. We'll do this. We'll do a big filter. Uh, like, um, that doesn't work, does it? Because we need a two. We need two. Oh, it's so complicated. <laughs> <laughs> we uh, will. What we'll do. Uh, if I just think. If you guys, just, guys, just let me think. Um... <laughs> we could put it here instead <laughs> oh hang on that would work if we move the door we'll move the staff door somewhere else but then we could put this one to there and then we can have a double thing here and there's nothing in there right now is there okay so this is we can this can be the the tank that I actually forget it it's just too much isn't it it's too complicated let's just um let's just build a giant dedicated tank for the big stuff what was this one for that one i guess And we'll add another power thing, like, to there. Okay, so all of these now has some sort of adequate... I'm assuming this one was assigned to that one. Yeah, okay, cool. Nice. Alright, so all these tanks are good. Good, nice. So we'll add a, we'll add a, ded a dedicated zone to make use of the large filter and stuff. Let's do that now. Actually, no, we should probably put some more fish in these empty tanks before I just... I like just building all the tanks and then realising I'm running money. So, let's see. Uh, right, what are we... Let's all, these are all the little ones and they don't have any caveats attached to them because none of them are bullies. He just doesn't like people who are the same as him. So we just have one... We'll, we'll fill up this big one. So we'll fill up one and then we'll have like two of the rest like that there we go and we'll just uh, fill it up put some grass at the back and some rocks at the front and some plants I don't know <laughs> nice one and you know what? I kind of miss that wooden cave. I'm, I'm feeling nostalgic for the wooden cave. Where is... I'm not used to this UI yet. There we go. Nice one. So got one there. Why not? Another one there. Well, let's, just do, let's just go nuts. So let's see. That tank's done. Oh god, we need caves. Okay. Sorry, mandems. I'm on it. I'm on it. How do I clear up this decoration? Can I, do I have to, can I not just delete it? Do I have to just relocate it? Whatever. Nice. Okay, that's all fine now. In fact, that tank even looks even better. Sweet. So, let's just fill up this one this time. Yeah, you've got to spare money space. So we've done all these ones. So, this guy, again, needs a cave. And there's a cave in there. And he will eat, he will eat things. Oh, because this is the guy that eats crustaceans. So there was no coral groupers in this tank, right? No, okay, we're fine. Yes! Okay, uh, that guy looks cool. You are not my first armoured animal. They count as twice the size when determining whether they can be eaten by a predator. This makes them excellent tank mates for your fish and crustacean-eating animals. What, 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 what? 
Excellent tank mates for your fish and crustacean eating animals. I was in animals that are predatory. Okay. <laughs> oh, so he needs mussels. We probably need to put a mussels thing in here at some point. Uh, let's, let's just do that now. Let's do that now. Where? There we go. I probably need another tool station as well, don't I? So that's all still accessible if that's there. Cool. Let's put a tool station in here. Let's put a tool station in here. Nice. Okay. This is going pretty well. So, how full was this thing doing? It's only that one guy so far. So where's the armoured guy? Oh god, he needs cockles! <gasps> this changes everything! <laughs> Put it, GG, putting it in the bloody furthest tank away. Let's put it next to that tank. There is no route between this task and a supply. Oh, because I've just blocked it off with the, with the cockles. Ironic, he could save others from death. Can staff get through? No, they can't. I mean, I feel like you could easily get through there, mate, but whatever. There we go. Oh, hang on, that tank's now blocked, isn't it? I'm so bad at this game. I mean, hang on, there we go. So, guys, welcome back to my tutorial on um, on this game. So, this is where the cockle supply is. You may as well add more of the armoured stuff in here. What else does he do? He, he eats all damages starfish. And he growths. Hang on, we'll grow to nine. Okay, so we can easily accommodate. We can put two in there and we should be fine. Uh, what's the capacity? Oh god, no, we can't have two in there. What's the capacity of this one? Okay, um, forget it. We'll move him. So there. Great. Well done. <laughs> right, and then, but he doesn't eat anything, so we can just put some more crustaceans in here. And... Actually, let's just make sure. Armoured. Eat starfish. You can eat starfish. Okay. Ah, oh, let's put another E on it. <laughs> Which is the one that eats crustaceans, actually? I want to make sure. It's this guy, right? This is the guy that eats crustaceans. Where's the... I've already lost it. No! <laughs> is it that one? I know it's one of these ones that eats crustaceans. There we go, that one. Coal grouper. Okay, so then we'll just add a few of these boys. Now, what, how many... Oh, hang on. Oh, I'm such an idiot. We're going to have to move this guy. Because I've overfilled this tank. Uh, let's move the crustacean there. Um, um, yes, is that done? 12, we better move, better move this guy, there we go, but there's two, there's two boys in here, and they, I don't know how much they've grown, it's all going wrong, oh, they haven't grown, um, let's put some, we're gonna have to move one of these guys, let's uh, move him, let's move one of the longhorn people into the giant tank. There we go. <gasps> oh god. Is there a risk of death? Okay, hang on. Uh, pause. No, not fast forward. Not my eels, mate. Not my eels. Love my eels. Poor water quality. Well, worry not. Because... Aha! I am the best at this game. Why is no one feeding my fish, BTW? I feel like these tanks were just a mistake, weren't they? I lo that guy loves it though. He loves that tank. Just a uh, uh, sea lettuce. <laughs> How is my prestige? I must be there, surely. This hasn't even moved. Look at all this stuff I've added. Ooh, new animals unlocked. 
Fox face rabbit fish. Excellent. Uh, we'll get that guy then. And, oh, I nearly win. But I want an excuse to use the giant stuff. I don't know why, but let's do it. So let's, can we not just build like a giant tank? <laughs> I guess I'll just build a big lagoon then, won't we? Lagoon Mark II is coming. So we'll do this. And add like a little staff room. Literally just a dedicated staff room though, none of this. Oh, we can line it with tanks again, because we've established that's a bad idea. Much like this horrendous layout I've just done for the staff room. Hopefully that's good enough. Hopefully that will work. We can always expand it. Yes! You've accomplished a lot here at Northwoods. When you arrive, it was dilapidated. You've restocked it, reinvested your profits, and transformed it into the impressive aquarium that you see before you. Another job offer has come in, this time for a private collector in Elmshorn looking for an architect to design their dream aquarium. You can continue here. I will continue here for a second. I've got to set up this lagoon tank for my, you know, my replacement. So, you know, they, they're going to come in not knowing what I was doing. Understandable. Where's the staff door? There it is. <laughs> I will learn this UI eventually. So this is obviously going to have to be pumped. So what we'll do... Yeah, this doesn't work. We'll just leave it up to someone to do damage control. You, Ulrika. You are now the manager of this aquarium. Treat it right. Treat it right. I have faith. But I'm moving to bigger things. So, best of luck. Goodbye. To you guys watching at home as well. I <laughs> uh, hope you enjoyed this episode. Rather rambly episode of me just trying to figure things out. And now I'm ready to take the job in Elm Storm. I will see you on the other side. Oh, yeah, I'm ready.